Doge is testing a key resistance level and if that sounds interesting you make sure to continue watching this video. Hey guys, Pingu Charts here. Welcome back to another Doge analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. As you guys can see on Doge yesterday, we had a beautiful retest of the 11 cent resistance, which we did mention would be a perfect opportunity to be entering that shorting position. There are a few things I want to talk about in this video. So number one, of course, is the fact that you can see, although we did retest that 11 cent resistance level, we didn't see that bearish volume come in. We did get a nice wick below the exponential moving average for the 20, but we didn't get that con information break that we were looking for as of right now doge of course is retesting that resistance level once more and again we are not seeing that level of course break because of the fact that we are entering the overbought territory looking for a long position at this level is going to be very very risky which i have mentioned to you guys in previous videos as well but i did want to talk about one thing if somehow the bulls can of course get above this level in a short squeeze and actually find that level as support doge will be in a very bullish momentum trade the reason why of course is looking at the previous price analysis you can see that we tested this 11 cent support level multiple times before we finally had that break to the downside as of right now though if doge does break above this level we could be looking for a possible move going all the way up around that 12.4 the reason why that level is so important is because that's pretty much where the move set started and we had this massive waterfall effect to the downside and as of right now our consolidation zone is looking more bullish and bullish right when you have doge bouncing off the these exponential moving averages as support and a continuation pattern on the four hour this is an extremely bullish momentum trade ideally what i am looking for of course is a possible pullback opportunity back down to around the eight cent level and then the continuation because of the fact that we are entering the overbought territory but i did want to talk about something that is interesting looking at doge on previous price analysis when doge had its massive run up like this we saw the same sort of pattern right i mentioned to you guys in a video three days ago that doge is looking to retest a resistance point but it might be better to wait until you're short because of the fact looking at this analysis you see that we did test the highs here around that 15 cent level but then a day later we retested those highs once again right now we are seeing the same sort of formation but we aren't seeing that same bearish volume that came in on doge previously that we are seeing right now right we just aren't seeing those strong bearish engulfing candles form so this would mean that doge is still looking to retest higher levels before finally consolidating to a lower point ideally at this point we have to be very careful of course looking for those shorting opportunities because with doge these comes with extremely big risks right when you are trading something so volatile you have to keep in mind that you have to place your stop losses and in my opinion right now shorting doge is going to be very very risky until we get a clean break below these exponential moving averages looking at the hourly time frames you can see that doge is looking more and more exhausted but we are consolidating right above these exponential moving averages when this tends to happen and you use these as support while retesting a major resistance point nine out of ten times you will see a strong break formation to the upside so keep a very close eye on to see how this 11 cent reacts of course if we do get a nice wick above and then immediately after that bearish engulfing candle that would be our confirmation to start looking for those shorting positions but until then we have to wait until we see a proper break right now we are just testing these resistance levels so of course no clear break as of yet but anything breaking below the support level here around that 0.99 that would give you that hourly confirmation to at least look for a shorting entry back to that 0.08 looking at the daily time frames really quickly you can see that doge is pretty much in a massive run up we did break above these exponential moving averages we found a beautiful support line around that 0.07 and right now doge is looking to to retest at least to around this level right here in terms of wicks to 0.118 the reason why of course this level is important you can see that we did test this level as support as well as resistance before we got the confirmation to the downside so that would be a perfect take profit level for the bullish case scenario and then the continuation that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit the like and subscribe button thank you guys so much for watching and i hope you guys have a wonderful day